Hey, welcome miniature adventurers, and welcome to another Aliens, another glorious day in the core, LV-427, review slash Hadley's Hope build update. So, right now, I have managed to start printing off the reactor pieces. So, if this is where... Um, if you have, if you've seen the movie, they basically go looking for the colonists in the reactors, and things go bad. I ordered a whole fire. Coming out of the goddamn wall. Coming out of the goddamn wall. Look. In here, uh, there's certain missions. Um, basically, they've got to go and explore and find out. Now, this is also used for a few of the other missions whereby Ripley finally comes face to face with the Queen after Newt has been um, captured. And so these are pretty much universal boards. Now, these are the final, uh, these are the final sides to the operations which are here. So there's four here. One, two, three, and now I have another one over there. Four. And then there will be eventually four of these. So one, two which we'll take a look at in a minute and then three and four and that will basically be most of the core set i think i think we have the apc chase ones but these take place now these don't have to be as the same with the, with the um have these hope these don't have to be used in aliens and other glorious day in the core these can be used in um avp the hump begins because they are split up so you could do one two three four Aliens, the role-playing game, absolutely would be fantastic because these don't necessarily have to be the reactor. This could be an infested ship or an infested colony. Um, it's kind of similar to the Hadley's Hope, but these um, are also separate. And I just have to say, I love the detail. There are eggs in here, I believe, on some of the walls. There may even be colonists. I don't think there are any on this version. Um, but I think there are some of the others. You could certainly glue them to them, which is what I'm thinking of doing. Um, but I just, I love this, the look of this. This, this just, yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm swamped with painting. I haven't even started painting this stuff yet, and I'm already onto this. Um, completely modulus. You could use these, um, as well as the other three ones are printed in different configurations, pretty much what you want. They have the standard doors, so you can use the Wayland yutani doors from the other sets, just like that, or we could swap it out, and basically I think this one will fit. There we go, and put the damaged one in. So this is reactor map one, so let's go and take a look at reactor map two. Alright guys, so this is reactor map 2. Now this is the APC one. I haven't printed off the APC, but I do have a copy that we can kind of show. So what you'll get is half the APC that will basically fit here. You could just use this, but it comes with it, so why not? And basically this is obviously part of the movie where the APC is smashed into the reactor. And they're trying to rescue the Marines. So I believe that one actually comes over here. And then we're going to have another one down and then down. So again though, this is just beautiful. Like I can't wait to add. What I may do is add some E400 glue in places. Just to kind of give it a bit more slimy look. But I mean look at the detail on this. This is absolutely beautiful. And like I said, you get the APC. It won't have the interior, you don't need it, um, but it's half the APC, um, because that's the objective. And just look, more eggs, you've got open eggs there, you've got some more eggs down here. Um, and it's going to be kind of really thematic to have, you know, your marines who have just got here, and maybe they're being chased by a horde of aliens. Ah! Um, yeah, no, he's facing the wrong way. But yeah, you get the point. So this is this is the APC part, and I I just yeah, it's same quality as these, absolutely. Just you know, it's in the reactor. 
Um, like I say, they've got Reactor 1 and Reactor 2 currently available. Um, I just, I'm really excited to, you know, have this all set up and be able to play through. Now, I'm hoping to start doing at least a playthrough of Mission 1 soon. Um, and then I think this is Mission 2, because they've basically gone to explore over. But that is, you know... That is the Reactor 1 map. Now, one other thing I did want to look at, which I don't think I had in the other video, which I was printing off. Let's get rid of this over here, just so we can kind of show you. Yet again, I have no idea I'm going to store this. So, this is a piece I printed off, just because I wanted it for the future. Now, this connects the LV427 um, generic tiles to their Hadley's Hope stuff. Uh, I think it goes this way around. Yep, here we go. So that basically you can interconnect them. Um, they do a fantastic range of alien themed terrain, not just for aliens and other glorious down core, or the alien board game, or even the hunt begins, but just alien themed. And they all use this section. So this is a good way to bridge the sets and basically just expand it on and just continue on i personally would like to maybe connect this up to the reactors and do a mission that way because i mean for aliens and other glory stay in the core pretty much create your own missions you just follow the same rules so it'd be kind of cool to have maybe that um or maybe connect this to a um service ducts entrance and have the ducts work all the way over i'm not sure yet but yeah, this is this is something I wanted to show you. Um, I believe this is three dollars on their store. Like I say, I bought it because I want to kind of maybe expand a little. Um, same kind of design as you see in Hadley's Hope, slightly different. And then we just have the two distinct different doorways. So we have the Hadley's Hope way, and then this way. And this one is actually slightly smaller, so you'll see that you obviously can't fit that in there. But it will fit there and just bridges the gap. I, I don't think I brought that up in the other video. If I did, then I'm sorry. But yeah, so that's that's that. Otherwise, like we say, pretty much just connect this up and this up. And then you've got an entrance way. Now, I have got another video coming up soon that's going to be really kind of cool for this set. Um, no sneaky peeks on that. But yeah, so... Uh, that is it for this version of the map hey guys competition time thank you to everyone who's been commenting on the videos absolutely warms my heart to see you guys uh, backing me with this massive massive project it is huge so we do have a winner uh, timmed7709 you are a winner so you'll get the voucher for the um, LV427 train. So you can just email them at sales at lv427-designs.com. They'll basically send you that voucher and go pick up. Maybe pick yourself up a couple of pieces of sets of this. Um, I want to say thank you to everyone. The community has been absolutely fantastic with this. Um, it is a lot of work, as you can imagine, getting all of this printed and and done and the comments are just absolutely fantastic so i want to say thank you i also want to say thank you delvey 427 uh, for their support on uh, constant questions and things regarding this um we've got a lot more planned like i said in the, in the video we've got um obviously the two more reactors coming um and then obviously we're going to be going on to the expansions and then we do have a super secret project that is coming um, in the next video. Keep watching for that, especially if you like Hadley's Hope or you like Aliens, but you want to maybe have the outside. Hmm. Keep an eye on that. So, guys, that's it. Please, 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 if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Hit that like button and uh, hit that notification button so you'll know when we're releasing new videos. If you're a fan of this project and you'd like to support it, we do have Patreon. Um, basically, the minimum is, I think, five bucks a month. And what that would do is help with the filament, help with 
um, just the general costs of, of this project as you can imagine they are quite big um, and just basically helping the channel but no pressure I just I love hearing from you guys so just keep dropping those comments we will see you in the next video